So what I have out to everybody, and you get to take them with you, is a $10 promotional item. Um, and as you probably all know, we recently added printing services to our business. And this is a really good way, an easy way, to put together something that makes a memorable impression for a customer. So the, it's a $10 promotional item that um, I put together, and that's a retail promotional item, um, that you could give a potential customer, a really good customer, um, whomever, you could have it as a party favor. It doesn't have to be a customer. You could be throwing an event, a party, um, for like Dominica throws parties for people that she buy and sell houses, as she told us. Um, you could have something like that up. You could have an open house and have it, put candy in it or whatever. It's just an easy way to do a small run versus, like Michael has had them in the past, and he probably orders them at 250 at a time. We can do 250 at a time, but if you only want to give 10 away, 3 away, or 1 away, we can do that too. And it's a new product I just recently stumbled on when we were at a trade show a couple of weeks ago. Um, they make a cube, they make a golf ball holder, uh, they make this weird little envelope type thing that pops up, which I'm not really sure what you put in it, maybe a gift card or something. I mean, it's kind of a weird shape. But they can all be produced in-house. Um, it's really, there's templates available, so if you have a graphic artist, they can, we can send them the template, they can fill it all out, send it over to us, we can print it and send it, send it to you, you can pick it up, Lindsay can do it. I mean, they're, they're really simple things. So that's one of the things I wanted to show today um, is a way to make a really good splash for the customer. Another one that's really a must-have, and it's good that Keith brought these, um, are postcards. 4x6, 3x5, 5x7, new names. Um, there's another one over there that's a 4x6 that Aaron has. Postcards are like a must. Um, really bad experiment. Postcards are a must in your line of work, no matter what you do. If you work for yourself, you work for somebody else, you should always have a stack of postcards, like your business cards. Have a postcard and have something on it so that when you are somewhere, this has got a discount. And this is like, oh, I do need, I have furniture, I need to have a cleaner. It's hard to find a good cleaner. And here, look, I can save some money. So if you don't have a postcard, make a postcard. Whether you have Lindsay do it, whether you do it yourself and send it to me, and then I say, send it to Lindsay and have it cleaned up. <laughs> <laughs> Postcards are essential. Another one that I saw come around today, um, this isn't really a wrap card, it's a wrap card style, it's a little thinner weight. Um, we can do these too. So these are really super important. I'd call these your elevator speech because this should quickly summarize what does your company do, what can you do, what's your special, what is it in the fall and you need to do something in the fall, is it spring and prom time and so you're going to do hair. Whatever it is, wrap cards are really essential. Don't wait till three days before you're suddenly going to be at a trade show, home show, neighborhood event. You should always have a stack of these on hand, whether it's 100 of them, which we can easily do in-house, or 1,000 of them. Um, they're, they're just really good to have. You can have a single like this, you can have a trifold. I've got a folding machine. I can fold them for you. Um, same thing with mailings. When you're going to do mailings, they're, they're critical to do right. They're critical to have right. We can do them up in the shop. We can fold them up for you and have them all ready to go. We can take this and insert it into a mailing for you. We can, um, uh, I just lost my train of thought. Oh, with the mailing, we can do labels for you. You can send over your labels. We can print them out, have them ready for you to go. I have this one that came in the mail to somebody that doesn't live at my shop. Um, we can do these where you've got the pre-printed address. It's a specific kind of merge, but if you really want to target somewhere, these can be done. Um, it costs a little bit more for us to do this, but it saves you six hours of peeling and stick, peeling stick, peeling stick, mm -hmm. unless you have somebody that really likes to do that. <laughs> um, so that's, those are all new things that we've added in the last couple of months. The other one is business cards. Um, don't use this to print. <laughs> it's just, um, if you're using their templates, you have the same logo that everybody else has. I know three different people in West Seattle that have the same logo. One's a doctor, one's a lawyer, and one is a general consultant. And they all have this little filigree logo. It doesn't say anything about what they do. And so if somebody slaps that business card down, 
and you quickly look at it, it's like, mm, I, I don't know who I should refer this person to until you get out your glasses, if you wear glasses, and then say, oh, okay, they're a doctor. Oh, they specialize in whatever health care. Oh, I know the perfect patient for you. If you have a logo, you should have it printed correctly on that business card. Commonly placed, um, printed in a good quality paper, which we use. We do UV gloss at no additional charge. That's a nice shiny finish, um, which is on my business card. Print both sides. We do not charge you extra. Print both sides. Why give away free advertising real estate? That's what that is. Because people look at both sides. So print both sides. Some printers charge you more for both sides. We don't. It's all included. Our price points, $40 for $1,000. <laughs> um, most of our competitors are $99 for $1,000. We do the exact same cost. So that's another thing to, to think about. I can do little tiny runs of business cards. We can do quick business cards on the fly in-house. Otherwise, we send everything down to Portland where we have a co-op. I think I've mentioned that in the past. We have a, a co-op print shop down there where we don't have to own the $1.3 million printing press. We just pay a monthly fee on that. Um, copy service. We do have a copier. We have two of them in-house. They're networked together. And if you are going to go do forms or do something, don't use your little inkjet printer that you have sitting on your desktop because it's really expensive. If you do the math, a gallon of ink is almost $3,000. Those little tiny cartridges. That's why those refill places make a lot of money. Um, email it over, I'll print it and have it ready for you. It means little as a half an hour. It just depends upon how many sheets. I can drill it, three ring. I can um, bind it for you. That's that plastic spine bind thing. We can do those in house. Staple it, collate it. Uh, we have one lady that we do her presentations. She teaches classes all over the United States. She does 15 sets every six weeks and we three ring bind them for her. We can do all that stuff in house. So think of printing services, take a look at what you have on your shelf and then take uh, an assessment and let's talk printing. All PB and JTEC sales.